on everyone, it's KT Pop here, coming at you with a brand new video. Woo! Woo! Have fun! <laughs> the start of every video now. Have fun! Hi everyone, as you're probably going to be able to tell, I am pretty sick right now. Fully sick. <laughs> Can't even lift my arms to the right <laughs> position. That's how sick I am. I know I said that at the end of the unboxing bonanza, there was going to be a really big special video out for you guys. This is not that video. I really want to be in tip top condition with lots of energy for that video. So for now, here's two videos about 80s. We are no longer in the unboxing bonanza. I keep wanting to say that we're in the unboxing bonanza. I just keep buying more stuff and the unboxing bonanza will never end. I think we need the unboxing bonanza to end for my wallet's sake. I know that I say I'm excited every single time I come on here to unbox something, but this is something different. As you all probably know by now, 80s is one of my favorite, favorite groups of all time. Today, I picked up my photo book versions of their brand new album, Golden Hour. I don't even know if they call them the photo book versions. That's what I'm calling them. Photo book versions, platform, which is kind of like the polka, and then the digi pack. Is that it? That's like not a lot compared to what I was talking about earlier, Zero Base One. They have so many versions and it's really pissing me off, to be honest. Today is also a very, very special day because it is my Bias Yosang's birthday. Yay! It's a special day. It's a special day. Yeah, I even went to K-pop time today and I was like talking to everyone in the store about how it was his birthday. Like, what a fucking psycho. Everyone, it's your son's birthday and I'm getting the albums today. Look how special I am. What a loser. Here they are. They're actually so heavy. I feel like they're like two kilos for all of these. Oh, maybe more. I don't know, how good are you at estimating weight? Not that good. Do you even lift, bro? How does it feel? I don't know, it doesn't have a bar in the middle. <laughs> maybe like four. Four kilos? Four kilos? Probably a lot of good shit in here. I do actually have a little bit more knowledge about what's actually in these because I just can't avoid spoilers because they are literally everywhere. I'm so excited! Hey, please, present! So here they are! Yay! They look and feel so nice and I'm so excited. Blue hour version, diary version, Golden hour version. I know what the versions are. How crazy. <laughs> You're really setting the uh, benchmark quite high for this video. Why? I'm starting with the blue one. But first, <laughs> should we look at the pops first? So I pre-ordered these albums from K-pop Time and they came with pre-order benefits, but you didn't really know which store they were coming from. I had assumed that I would get pops from one store and I would probably get one photo card per album and get random members. However, it turned out the owner of K-pop Time knows that he's my bias and managed to organize that for me so that I had three different pops from three different stores for him. So let's take a look because they are super, super cute. Let's start with the first one. Here we have him with him. <laughs> we have him with a little pink dolphin plushie. Super cute. I believe this one is from Apple Music. I think this is great. Typical pose of him. He loves this side of his face. All the photo cards always have this. A really nice top here, gray, quite um, low cut. Can see a little bit of the uh, chest there, which is always nice. And the back is, yeah, pretty plain. Just black, golden hour, part one. AT's on the back. It doesn't have the store on this one, but this one is definitely from Apple Music. Yay! Here is the second one. We can see that we've got a little bit of a theme running here. There's another pink plushie, but now it is a paw print instead of a dolphin. <laughs> to hold it in. Rude! This one is from Tok Tok. So yeah, we've got two probably taken on a similar day with um, similar plushies, but they were given to different stores to distribute. Dis different stores to distribute. That's a bit of a tongue twister, that one. But yeah, this is very, very cute. I think I prefer the other one a bit more. This one looks a little bit more heavily edited, like his face has been a bit more slimmed and his skin looks a little bit more bright. And on the back, this one is this, I don't know, sand color. AT's on the back there, no store written on there. He always looks cute. Look at him. The last one is this one from With Mew. I think it's With Mew. With M-U-U. -U. With Mew. With Mew. Here, same outfit. 
even more chest out this time. I love to see it. And a little pen with a, I don't know, some sort of pom-pom on the top of it. It's like one of those cute pens that you use at school and you make all your friends jealous because you've got like a plushy, fluffy pen. Yeah, I'm loving it. His hair looks nice here too. It's like kind of gone a bit more messy and swept across. And on the back, this one actually has the store name on here with Mew and a beige color. Golden Hour Part 1. Obsessed! This is great because now I don't have to go and buy these on the secondary market for like $15 pop. Um, I got them with my album, so that is a huge win. All right, let's get into our Blue Hour version. We need to zoom out the camera. Okay, so let's get into the first version. We have a Blue Hour version here, and it is blue. Wow. Pretty simple design here. 80s 10th mini album. Oh my god. On the back, not a lot. KQ Entertainment. Love QK. QK? Love KQ Entertainment. Very, very simple. We're back to these box designs. A lot of the sort of older 80s albums had this design of the little box and they kind of moved away from them. So I think a lot of people are going to be pretty happy that we've moved back to this type of packaging. It's like a nice little magnetic flip box. Let's get into it. I'm too keen. Josh is like, calm the fuck down. <laughs> Went straight for the nail. No fucking around. Oh, it feels so good. I knew it was gonna have this kind of texture to it. Yeah, I don't even know how to explain this texture. It's like an old book. It feels so good. Like bumpy, feels very good quality. All right, let's have a check of the uh, magnet thing going on here. Yep, we've got some magnets. Magnets. How do they work? Oh, I'm a bit scared. All right. Oh, this is so cool. 31st of May, 2024. So that's the date that the album came out. ATs is pleased to invite ATNE to celebrate Golden Hour Part One. Like a little invitation thing. That's so cute. It's really nice that you open up the album and that's what you see on the top. That's very cute. And then I guess we have our first inclusion here. So we've got a little postcard in a frame. All the members there. I'm sure you can kind of pull it out. Yep. So there we've got a little postcard. Oh, the back of that is a really nice gold color. Golden hour. These outfits are pretty slay. So this might be the concept that's gonna be in this photo book. They're wearing a lot of like sheer shirts and like kind of oversized pants. <laughs> it's very, very nice. So I'm excited to see what the photo shoot looks like. So that's nice. I guess you could, what are you gonna do with this? Like you get some inclusions sometimes where they've got the little thing on the back that you can like pop out and so then you can have it sitting there on your desk like it's a family photo or some shit. A little kickstand. So that could have been kind of nice. But this actually feels so nice. What is this? The textures of this are vibing. Here is like the little scan card. There's like a game, I think. I've actually never really done it, but you can scan this little code and it updates something in the game for you. So there's that. Then this must be where all the other inclusions are. They all come in a little envelope with a little blue flap. So we will save that until the end and get into the photo book. Let's pull that out and see if there's anything underneath. Just the CD, pretty simple blue design on there. And you know, I'm gonna have to see if there's anything under here. Oh, it actually pops out. Secrets? No, no secrets. <laughs> um, just a very hefty piece of cardboard there. Who am I fucking? <laughs> Dancing bacons. A lot of the weight comes from that hefty bit of cardboard there. I'm a bit scared to get into this. I think there's gonna be some pretty spicy stuff in these photo books, so let's see how I go. 80s. That looks similar to the picture from the little postcard we just saw before, but a bit more front facing. Front facing. I'm getting my words all jumbled up because I'm looking at this and I'm seeing like just skin. <laughs> it's very distracting. Okay. Let's go. Ah, there's the captain, the captain himself. Love this orange hair on him. Looks freaking amazing. Oh my God, Slay. How are his legs so long? You will be lengthening your own leg by turning the threaded bar on the frame. Ah, the colors are so nice. Seems like they've really matched the outfits to like the color scheme of the photo book. Like these beige and orange tones with the blue. So ah, this purple top is so cool. 
He just always serves. Look at him. What? What is this body? Wow, his lips look good there. Wow. That is incredible. We all know I love a profile shot. That is ultimate. Gosh, he's just one of the prettiest men. You know, silky shirt. Oh, that's such a cute little expression. Looks like a little puppy dog. <gasps> Look at his arm. What the hell? I feel like my, my head's gonna get in the shot because I'm just like trying to see it closer. <laughs> this is why I shouldn't open like ATs on camera because it's just a little chaotic. And the shine like on the cheek, like hello. This shirt is so cool. Oh my God, I just cannot. He is the most beautiful man I've ever seen in my life. Ah. That's cool. He doesn't often have photos where he like has his eyes like that closed. Oh my God. This is what I'm talking about. This song has like the most ultimate side profile in K-pop and no one can argue with me on that. <sighs> I just feel like I can't even breathe. And this must be the middle, I think. We've got a little group shot here. Honestly, these outfits are really, really nice. They pull these off very well, these oversized looks. Sun, looking smoldering as always. Yes, get it. <laughs> it's interesting. Oh my God. Mingy nipples, everyone. That is crazy. That is a lot. Wow. The combination of the kind of baggy pants and the top being kind of tighter and sheer just makes his body just look crazy. Oh my God. All of the angles. <laughs> you wanted to see me from all angles? Here it is, people. Oh my goodness. Booyang looks sad there. Well, that's a good color for him actually, this blue. Really makes her skin like pop. Joho, baby. That's a kind of interesting brooch. Doesn't really go with like the theme of the rest of the album. It's very like vintage, but it's a vibe. Yes. I'm loving Joho these days. He's so freaking cool. Another group shot here, a bit closer up. And then the track list. Work was the title track for this album, which has been stuck in my head um, since it came out. Well, since the teasers came out, it will never leave my head, I fear. Um, which is fine, <laughs> I don't mind. I can't wait to learn the choreo. It's like quite kitsch and fun. I think it's just gonna be a vibe. I think everyone in the class will really enjoy it. So it's just gonna be like posy vibes. Overall, like a really solid album. I'm a big fan of pretty much all the songs actually. Blind is really great. Shaboom, even though like a few people I've spoken to don't particularly like it because they think it's a little bit cringe, but I kind of enjoy that cringe factor. And obviously Siren um, is amazing. Everyone loves Siren. Um, definitely one of the best songs in the album. So check that one out if you haven't listened to the whole album. Lyrics and the credits at the back. Gotta work. Gotta make that money make us. Yes. Lovely, beautiful album. I really love the colors. I think the blue and the outfits that they've chosen, the colors go together really well. So it's like just super aesthetically pleasing. I love that. All right, let's get these. Oh, that's a random inclusion, I'm pretty sure. That's okay, we can start off that one. Okay. I don't think I saw anything, but I did see this. This postcard is a random inclusion. So we got, you know, very cute little postcard there in his silver shirt. Silver? That's gold, Kate. Golden hour. They always try to make it look like a postcard. Look, it's got like a little stamp and everything. These must be the stickers. Okay, what do we got here? These all look like stamps. It would be good if they actually were stamps. Can you imagine that? It's like, here you go, Ateeny. Here's some stamps that you can use to do buy, sell, trade for your ATs photo cards. I think people would really appreciate that, to be honest. And they never use them. Yeah, I know. It's like, I've got to collect them. I can't use them. But they're not bad stickers. I do like the colors. I like the gold and the blue. And here, I don't know what these are. I think this is another sticker. Yeah, we just got an AT sticker here. I'm not gonna peel it. And what is this? A bookmark? Let's find that picture of my boyfriend that I liked. I like 
them all. I'm like, which one was it that I liked? You like all of them, Kate, don't be ridiculous. I think it's this one. So let's bookmark this page with our brand new goal now bookmark. Yay! <laughs> and now we have the photo cards. So I believe there are two photo cards per member per album. So that's really fun. Lots to collect. So the photo cards with the gold backgrounds are the A version photo cards and the ones with the different colored backgrounds are the Z version photo cards. So each version will have gold ones and then different colors for the different versions. We are trying to pull your sang today. Are we gonna get him? I'm never super, what's the word? Optimistic. I'm never super optimistic because I feel like I never really pull him. Um, but let's see how we go. I'm happy to get anyone. I have a lot of friends that are 18 so we like to do trading and there is a big buy, sell, trade community in Australia. So it is quite easy to collect what you want. So let's see, manifest. We will start with the A version. I'm more nervous about this than I am about most photo card pools because I actually fully collect um, your sang for album photo cards. So I do need them. Need is a strong word, but I do need them. Okay, we got Wu Young looking very cute here with the little hand like this um, against a wooden door. Everyone loves to take photos against wooden doors. And he's in his lovely, I thought he was wearing blue in the album, wasn't he? Oh, well, he's wearing green in this one. This is very nice. His skin looks absolutely flawless. Insane. Let's look at what else we got for the Z version. I feel like it's Yuno. Let's see. I was wrong. It is Songwa. Wow. He's like so freaking pretty. I love this purple top on him and the white drapes over him is just ethereal. I know someone that would really love this photo card. So I'm excited to show her. It's your boyfriend. <laughs> These are very pretty photo cards, actually. I'm very impressed with these. ATs always have very, very pretty photo cards. So I'm very, very excited to see who else we pull in the other versions. All right, next version, let's fucking go. We've got the diary version here in a white color with gold print. Pretty similar to last time. We don't need to go into the details. Let's just fucking get into it because I'm so keen. Ah. <sighs> A lot of screaming in this video. Okay, we've got the little magnetic clasp again. Let's open it up. Yay, we're invited again. Imagine if only one of them had an invitation. It's like, you're invited to this album, but not this one. Um, it's exactly the same. Please to invite AT to celebrate golden hour part one. Cute. Similar to last time, we've got a little postcard here of all the members in a white frame this time. On the back, the gold color again. So here we have the more kind of black suit version concept. So that's what we will be seeing when we open up the photo book. Ooh, that's like embossed. This is fucking fancy as, man. KQ going all out. This also reminds me of a wedding invitation. <laughs> that's probably what they're going for, right? Fucking Delulus. <laughs> Could never be me. My boyfriend, my boyfriend, my boyfriend, my boyfriend. And <laughs> you've got your little um, code card thing and the little pouch this time with a, a gold flap. Photo book. And underneath a white CD with gold print. I bet there's something under here this time. Oh, oh my God. I, oh my God. I just fucking cooked that. I'm getting too overexcited. <laughs> Oh, there's nothing there. Sad. Imagine if they did actually like put random stuff in the bottom of some of these and like just didn't tell you. And maybe some people would find them like 20 years later and it's like an 80s Easter egg. No one's found the golden egg inside the album for 20 years. But alas. Yeah, everything is like so detailed. Like this is embossed as well. Incredible. Let's get into it. 80s. Oh, this wasn't in the other version, was it? This like contents page with all the members' names and an intro and what pages they're on. Because this is the diary version, I think there's probably gonna be some like more sort of personalized things for the members. So 
it makes sense that it's got a bit of a contents page. Intro here. So for each of the members, there's like a bit of a law storyline written in here in Korean and in English. So I will definitely go and read this later. Your song, his employees call him Young and Rich, Tall and Handsome. Is this some like Zero Base One crossover? Like what is happening here? I'm sure someone else has realized that. That is so freaking weird. Okay, I'm just gonna have to move on from that because that's just kind of blown my mind a bit. Okay, and then we get into the photos in the photo book. Them in their black suits with a bit of leather going on as well. They are so hot. What is that? Hmm. Just standing on a leather chair. I really like jackets that have kind of like oversized details, like really long zippers and big buttons and stuff. Like that looks really cool. And he's got his little captain armband on here. Wow, okay. <laughs> yep, that is more action whenever I see Songwa. Just that smoldering look is absolutely fucked. Oh, I love a beret and he really pulls off a beret. I feel like he often wears one. Obsessed. This is a really cool coat too, because it's like a normal suit jacket, but then it flares out and it's got this kind of pleating like a skirt. I love that. Ah, I feel like there's going to be a lot of <laughs> shots of me just staring at him and <laughs> just smiling like an idiot. Oh my God. He's honestly like my alt, alt bias these days. This is, it's an emotional time. <laughs> oh, like a turtleneck. That's pretty cool. Like pulled it up like that. Wow. Sun looking like some sort of rich mafia boss. That is a nice photo. I think Kai will like that one. Mingy. He looks so good in sunnies. That's a cool one. His facial expressions here are nice. Looks very um like cheeky. Ah, he looks so tall there. CEO vibes. Cute. Yeah, this is definitely giving Jongo CEO CEO vibes. And then we've got the track list at the back again. Another lovely photo book. Seriously, these are so just beautifully shot, and the outfits are crisp. I will definitely be looking at these in more detail later. All right, so let's get into the diary version inclusions in our little uh, gold envelope here. What did I do last time that just fucking ruined the entire uh, thing? I think the flap is at the top, so if you put the yeah, flap at the bottom. Yeah, if I just do that. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> I just really like um, the color combination of gold and white. Like this just looks so aesthetic, does it not? We've shown the stickers. Um, so the same stickers again, but just with that gold color. Stamps, but do not try and use these to do a buy sell trade. I don't think they'll work. 18. Postcard. Shall we see who we pulled for the postcard? We got Jongo. Yay, I'm happy with this. I'm very, very into him at the moment. So always happy to get one of his inclusions. Again, we've got the little bookmark, little A tier sticker. Let's get into the photo cards. What did I do last time I did them this way, didn't I? Because that's how it's supposed to be. <laughs> so let's start with the A version photo card. Who are we gonna get? I'm feeling Hong Joon. I don't know why. Nope. <laughs> we got Woo Young. Oh my God, we're getting a lot of him. But I like this. I like this one better than the other one, actually. I always love like a cheeky expression, a little peace sign up there and one of those kind of confetti walls. No, streamer walls, like a celebration wall. And he's in his little black suit. I do like this one a lot. I think it's nice, but let's get some more variation. But maybe we'll get Songwa now. Maybe that's what we're going to get. We're just going to get Ooyoung Songwa combo for all the albums. Let's see who we get. Ah! Ah! Okay, no, that's pretty good though. <laughs> we got Hong Joon here um, in his black suit with orange hair. I just got very excited about that. I really like this one. He looks very, very good here. So yeah, at least we got someone different. So now we've pulled three different members. Very happy with the quality of these photo cards. ATs always look really nice in their photos. It's like they really try hard to get good photos for ATNI. So happy. Always save the best for last, right? <laughs> here we go. The last version. We have a golden hour version. I believe it's called golden hour part one golden hour version. That's not too difficult to remember, is it? Again, very similar. This one actually looks really nice because you've got the gold on the black. I mean, they all look nice. I think the white one looked really good as well. The blue one is probably like the least 
aesthetically pleasing on the outside, but this looks beautiful. <sighs> Another invitation. Oh my God, I'm so surprised. AT is pleased to invite AT to celebrate Golden Hour Part 1, 31st May 2024. Yay, thanks. And we have the little postcard of all the members at the front in a black frame this time. This one's got some shit on it. I don't know what that is. It's like glue or something. Let's get this point. But yeah, now we have these black and brown sand colored outfits. These ones are very sexy. So I'm pretty excited to see the photo book. I don't know which of these concepts is my favorite actually. I kind of like them all. Maybe once I've seen this photo book, I'll make up my, my final mind, but your little, and the, uh, with the black tab this time. Let's put that aside. We have the black CD this time. Pretty, oh, Jesus, I smashed it. I will never forgive myself if there's an Easter egg in here and I haven't found it. Nope, gotta be in it to win it. All right, let's take a look at the photo book then, shall we? 80s. Yes, slay. I really do love the color palette of this too. All the color palettes have been amazing. Oh my God. That's Hong Joon's tits right there. That's so hot. Welcome to the photo book. <laughs> this is a very cool outfit. Is there like a hood on the back? Like a, like a wizard or something. Wow, these are so cool, the shadow photos. Ah, oh my God. <laughs> you cannot like just have a visceral reaction when you see this man. Like, it's insane. Look at the boots, come on. Yeah, this version is the best one. <laughs> I really love these shadow photos. Like this just looks incredible. Like what? I'm really scared to reach, you know, whose pages. Just, oh, he just looks so like, just gender, you know? Like, it's fucked up, really. The boots are everything and the glo- Oh my God. Yeah, I just really like what they've done with the cut of the clothes. Like, they've really gone for some interesting cuts because they can just like pull off any kind of silhouette. I'm really scared. Ah, I just knew he was gonna be the next page. Why is it so unbuttoned? Uh, wow, yes, yes. This version is the best version by far. Oh my gosh, she's just so beautiful. Look at the waist. Look at it. How? <sighs> she was too shocked to speak. She was too shocked to speak. Oh my gosh, look at them. How are they real? Just an entire chunk of the shirt is just not there. Thank you, stylists. Looks so bulky. For Songwa, it's just like, oh my God. For your song, it's like just gasping. And then Mingi, I'm just like nervous laughter. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so fucked. Wow, that's cool. Just, he's leaning back or? That's a really interesting pose. I don't think I've ever seen him do something like that before. That's a very like Mingi pose. That's what I expect. Yeah, the fucking shoes. Oh my God. Like actual heels. They're so slay. I love how they just wear whatever and just don't give a fuck. I just, I'm obsessed. Oh, I love him in this beanie. This ruined my life when I saw it the first time. Look, this, this is the coolest he's ever looked. I swear to God. Work, gotta make that money, thank goodness. Group photo at the end there, just from the top. So you can just see tits. <laughs> love that for us. Checklist. Again, all the lyrics and the credits. And that's the end of one of the best photo books I've seen in a while. That is gorgeous, gorgeous stuff. Um, I'm obsessed. I think I stopped breathing a few times there. All right, let's get into our inclusions for our last version here, a black flap. If I pull them out like that, that's right, isn't it? I believe so. Yeah. All right. Golden goose. <laughs> Stickers. Same again, but black and gold. Black and gold, black and gold. Well, that's a really weird cut, isn't it? The extra sticker, AT sticker, and your little bookmark to bookmark your favorite page in the photo book. And which random postcard did we get? You know, didn't we get his, his postcard in one of the other ones too? 
Yeah, I think in the Blue Hour version we got him as well. Very nice in his little sand outfit. It would have been cool if they used the um, the shadow photos for this. I think that would have been really cool. So how many uh, postcards does that mean there are? Um, there's so that, yeah, one there'll be... for each member in each version. Yeah, yeah. So it's another thing to collect. But that's only there's only two random inclusions in the album, so that's not that bad. There's only a postcard and then two photo cards per member. So three inclusions per version to collect, which isn't that bad, honestly. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so nervous. This was my favorite version, my favorite photo book. So maybe we will get my man this time. But let's start with the A version first. I'm gonna manifest, because this whole time I'm like, oh, I'm not gonna pull, I'm not gonna pull him. So I'm just gonna take a moment for just some manifestation here. It's his birthday. He's my alt. I deserve it. All right. I'm feeling good. Let's go. We got Woo Young <laughs> again. We have pulled him in every single album. So he's coming for me today. That's for sure. Quite a cute photo. This time we've got a little heart over the eye, kind of similar to the piece one, but just a heart this time in his gray jumper and black vest sweater combo in front of a white wall. Very cute. I will definitely be reaching out to my friends that are biasing him so that I can maybe do some trades. And let's see who else we get. Oh my God, I can't believe we got him again. This is so crazy. He has been coming for me all day. Here we have him in the same outfit, actually, just slightly different lighting. Um, yeah, I like this one a bit better because it's got like kind of a mood lighting thing going on. The shadow on his face is really cool. Like his skin looks really nice. So yeah, another cute photo of him. We now have a four photo cards of Wu Young that we've pulled in these three albums. So let's have a little look at all the photo cards that we pulled today. So here are all my photo card pulls from ATEEZ's new album, Golden Hour. We have the Blue Hour version ones here the diary version and the golden hour version. We also have my beautiful Your Sung Pobs. This one was from Apple Music, Tok Tok and With Mew. Unfortunately, we didn't pull any of my man, but I am very happy with the overall quality of these photo cards. The photos are super cute. We've got some variety in the backgrounds and the poses. So I'm very glad that I got the Pobs because otherwise I wouldn't have seen him today. <laughs> sad, sad. So if you buy a Swoyong, you can go to my Instagram and maybe we can set up a trade if you pulled some of my buyers. Thanks for watching my unboxing of the photo book versions of ATEEZ's Golden Hour. I really hope you enjoyed it. I had so much fun opening up these albums. They are absolutely gorgeous. Let me know which version is your favorite and who you pulled in the comments down below. If you enjoyed the video, please consider liking and subscribing. It would mean so, so much. Thanks again and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. the stuff I'm just riffing. What what last got the do Um I think it was literally just you showing the kingdom albums. <laughs> <laughs> I mean <coughs> posy vibes. Why do I sound so Aussie all the time? Like the country you live in. This is true. They're not issues. <laughs> it's just, just a fucking wing about I'm right. no, just joking. Just camera business. Yeah, business. Biznatch. I drink more gin and then I just forget everything about ATs that I've ever known in my entire life. Rip. Damn right, it's my fucking video. We're looking at the pops. You're doing a great job. Thanks, you too. Am I? Yeah. Oh. Yay! I love pops. You know I can edit things, right, Kate? Put your little hot pot on there and you're set. No one's gonna understand that, Kate. Oh, I thought I'd lost my inclusions. <laughs> what a surprise, I have a lot of feelings about 80s. <clears throat> Do you wanna put that one down so I can readjust the camera for it? Oh yeah. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, this is just like, <laughs> it's a lot. We then also have my beautiful Yasang P.O. P -O beat. <laughs> give me your love, give me your love, give me your love. Uh -huh. Give me your love, give me your love, uh-uh-uh. Baby, give me love. Ooh.